Okay, so hello everyone. From this video onwards, we are going to create a new playlist which is based on JavaScript. Okay, in this playlist, we are going to learn JavaScript. Okay, so we will learn JavaScript from scratch. Okay, this is this is the part one. So after learning JavaScript, you will not face you will not face difficulty while learning React.js. Okay, for example, you are learn learning React.js library, and if you are facing difficulty in code, so learn this JavaScript first so that you can easily understand that library. And after learning JavaScript, you can work on various libraries and various frameworks. I will tell you what are the frameworks and library you can easily explore after learning this JavaScript. Not only not only for mobile like web application, but you can implement, you can create the mobile application, step, desktop application, okay, like server side programming. So many things you can do after learning this JavaScript. So this is not only for practice; it is for learning frameworks and libraries based on JavaScript. Okay, so nowadays JavaScript is very popular. Or we can say it is kind of demand of our today's technologies because you know, so many like popular frameworks are written in JavaScript. Okay, so my first question is here: What is JavaScript? Okay, this is a very basic question. So I'll start with this question. Later I'll tell you like where exactly we can use JavaScript. What are the frameworks and libraries written in JavaScript? And what are the frameworks we can learn in order to make our career? Okay, because this is this course, this full stack development course is job oriented. Okay, so I'll teach you everything which is help you. In getting a job, okay. Because if you will not get the job, then what is the purpose of giving time on such kind of playlist? So this is job oriented, right? So whatever we will learn, we will learn job specific, right? So let me give the answer of this question. So basically, JavaScript, JavaScript is a programming language, okay, used for creating interactive web applications. Okay, so this is a simple definition. Okay, now let's see. Uh, like, like if you if you know the JavaScript, if you know JavaScript, then what technologies you can learn in future? Okay, so if if you know the JavaScript, then what are the technologies you can learn in future? So let me tell you what are the technologies we can learn. Okay, so first the very important thing. We can we can develop client side applications using JavaScript. Okay, so let me write here client side client side web development. Okay, so with the help of this JavaScript, we can create client side web development. Okay, so what are the libraries involved in client side web development? So here are some libraries like JavaScript. Okay, this is also involved in okay JavaScript. Okay. The main language. Okay, so this is what main language for creating interactive web application. Okay. Right. So this is the main language in order to create the interactive web application. And there are other languages also, like we can say jQuery. Okay, jQuery is also there, a library that simplifies. Okay, simplifies HTML document traversing event handling. Okay, so we will learn these things also and animating. Okay, so like with the help of jQuery, also we can do client side. Okay, client side development. Right, and what are the technology involved? Like Angular. Okay, so with the help of Angular, we can do client side. Web development. Okay, so what is Angular? Basically, you can say of Angular, a framework for building dynamic web application. Okay, so with the help of Angular, we can create dynamic web applications. Okay, then after that we have React JS. Okay, so React JS is what a library for building user interfaces. Especially single page application, right? And we have Vue.js as well. Vue.js, right? So this is what is Vue.js? A progressive framework for building user interface, right? So these are the technologies. You can. These are the technologies involved in. Client side web development. Okay. 
After learning JavaScript, you can learn these technologies as well. Okay, like React JS, Vue JS, okay, like Angular JS, right? And what is the second thing? Second is server side. After learning JavaScript, we can through server side, we can develop server, server side web development. Okay. After learning JavaScript, we can do server side web development, right? So, what are the libraries involved in order to develop server side applications? So, for implementing server side application, you need Node.js, okay, which is JavaScript library, okay. And then we have Express.js, okay. So, what is Express.js? This is what a web application framework, okay, uh, spelling mistake, framework for Node.js. Right, and then what is Node.js? What is Node.js? A runtime environment. Okay, this is what a runtime environment for executing JavaScript, JavaScript on the server, server side, right? On the server side, right? After that. Like what we can do after learning JavaScript, client side web development we can do, and these are the libraries involved which are written in JavaScript. Okay, and server side web development we can do using this JavaScript libraries. Okay, and then what we can what we can do after this using JavaScript we can create mobile application. Okay, mobile applications also we can create after learning JavaScript. So what are the frameworks involved in creating or developing mobile applications? So like React Native. So React Native is a library for cross-platform. Like after learning React JS, what you can do? You can create application for Android. You can create mobile application for Android as well as iOS. Okay. So for example, if you are writing React uh, code in React Native, so your application will run in uh, on Android platform as well as iOS platform. Okay. And then another library is we can learn. Okay, this is what Ionic. So this is what a framework. Okay, this is what a framework for building cross platform mobiles apps using web detections. Right. So these are the two frameworks you can master after learning JavaScript if you want to go if you want to go in what. If you want to go in mobile application development, okay. Not only that, but also we can we can create desktop applications. Okay, we can also create desktop application after learning JavaScript. So I'm telling you what are the major benefits after learning JavaScript. Okay. So what are the libraries involved in desktop application? So Electron. Okay, Electron. So this is a this is a cross platform application. Using JavaScript, okay. A platform we can say Electron. This is what. Okay, this is what a platform. A platform provided. A platform provided by GitHub. GitHub to build cross platform. desktop application right using javascript okay so if you want to create desktop applications so these application these li this library is involved okay so involved in order to create desktop application okay desktop ap applications like for example you, you want to create vlc layer okay and if you want to create some other apps like zoom app or like some editing software for desktop so those are the desktop applications you can create using this electron platform okay provided by the github and after that what you can do you can also create website plugins okay plugins or you can say extensions so this is also you can create after learning javascript okay if you want to make your career in any of these things so you can master after learning the javascript okay so like what is like javascript can create plugins and extensions for enhancing website functionality. Right.
and then what we can do what is another advantage so recent technology is what iot so we can also create iot apps after learning javascript okay so iot applications like what are the library is there in order to create this iot application so there, there is a library called johnny file right so this is what a javascript library for controlling hardware in and robotics so these are the these are the particular things or we can say these are the particular careers where you can use javascript okay so you can you can make your expertise in client side web development after learning the javascript okay so when you learn the javascript you can easily understand like jquery angular okay react js vue js you will not face any difficulty after learning javascript and if you want to develop something related to server side then definitely you can go for node js or express js okay this is this is based on javascript only mobile application which is react native javascript based okay and this another framework okay then we can also make our career in order to create desktop application after learning this electron okay like this is similar to the javascript website plugins we can create okay like uh, uh, so many extension we install whenever we use vs code so that extension can be writing javascript okay and plugins so many plugins we use in our browsers so that plugins also we can create using javascript and iot applications internet of thing related application also we can create after learning this framework and this framework or we can say this library is involved like this library uh, like this library using concept of javascript okay so if a person from javascript background so can go easily out of one okay for example you want to learn react js so definitely you can learn after after mastering javascript okay and and one more important thing is after learning javascript you can make your career in machine learning as well machine learning okay so how like what are the libraries involved in machine learning so like tensorflow tensorflow js in capital f tensorflow js is involved in machine learning okay so we can say a uh, javascript this is what a uh, javascript library for building machine learning models okay so we can create uh, our own machine learning models after learning this tensorflow js so once you have the knowledge of javascript then only you can learn this library right for machine learning models and javascript libraries or functionalities like okay okay so we have other javascript libraries for for functionalities like if you want to use functionality in your project like what kind of functionality you can use after after learning javascript that if you need a speech recognition so you can use speech speech recognition and barcode barcode scanner okay barcode scanner code you can implement after learning javascript okay so these are the libraries uh, this library is for speech recognition written in javascript barcode scanner okay written in javascript you can you can use this library for this kind of utilities okay okay like so in simple if i will if i say one thing to you if you want to if you want to learn any frameworks in library if you want to explore any framework or library then learn first javascript okay once you master the javascript then so many doors will open to you okay so so many opportunities come to you and so many doors will open right so that's why javascript is really important in order to master the recent technologies are coming okay so these are the career field, career career field you can make right so okay so this was the introduct introductory lecture where i taught you like where actually we can implement our javascript knowledge so these are the areas we can implement our javascript knowledge all right so thank you everyone for watching this video from the next video onwards we will start our our javascript program right so thank you everyone for giving your valuable time